Hey guys, it's Deligracy here and welcome to a brand new video. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the amazing new trailer that's just dropped, the Sims 4 Laundry Stuff Pack trailer. Oh my gosh, I've been waiting for this. I'm so excited. I have not watched it yet. I'm watching it with you guys for the first time. And excuse me, I'm just about to go to the gym, so I'm kind of like on my way out the door, but then I was so excited to watch this and then I was like, well, I can't watch it myself before making my reaction. <laughs> So anyway, let's check it out. Okay, you guys, I am personally very excited for this. I know laundry stuff pack isn't for everyone. I've definitely seen your opinions on that uh, when I did my reaction to the teaser trailer, but I'm personally very excited for this because laundry is like a laundry room in a home is something I've always grown up with. And I feel like not having it in my Sims house is just isn't simulating life. So I am very excited to make the game more realistic and to have that. Let's just go through it in a little bit more detail. Uh, I also have a feeling the music that they used for this is going to be copyrighted or flagged on YouTube. So there's a possibility that I may have to re-upload this with different music. I'll see how I go. Okay, so we have this really funny kind of introduction. It's very dramatic. The day has come to fulfill your destiny and fill your hamper. I love the humor in that. Now we're seeing a couple of new things as well. We've got a new wreath over here, which is actually really, really pretty. This is a new hairdo, um, new outfits. That hair's really, really nice. Uh, is this new hair? I think that's new hair and a new top as well. Oh my gosh. Okay, and we've already got new tops here. Two, this is gorgeous. So it's obviously a very rustic theme. It's looking a little bit country. I'm getting country vibes from it too. So there's the drying herbs. There's this gorgeous looking bay window with potentially a seat built into it. Uh, maybe, I don't know. Or maybe it's just a decor seat. I don't know if they'll be able to use it. Loving this chair. This is a retextured chair we've already seen, I believe, or it's very similar. New table, love the coffee cups. It's looking very like chilled out, new shirts, love this diamond pattern. It's obviously being used on a couple of things too. The Sims for laundry day stuff. Yay, we have our first washing machine here. Woohoo! Okay, love the washing machine. It's everything I expected and more. <laughs> and yep, very rustic sink over here. Loving the pine cones, these little baskets. I wonder if this basket is decor or if it's just under the sink. Uh, I know I'm going to be using that sink a lot. Love it, love it, love it. We've got some decor items that are laundry themed, pillows. The art's really, really nice. I actually think it's quite different to what we already have in the game. <gasps> Look at the curtain on the door. So cute. Brooms and cleaning things. I'm assuming a washing machine and dryer. Oh, ironing board. Cute, you guys. And yeah, we've got them in lots of different colors. And this is a slightly more modern contemporary setup over here. So I do like that we have that more industrial modern sink. That's going to be really, really nice to use. I love industrial more than rustic personally. So I'm glad that my aesthetic's been catered for as well. And yeah. What is this? Is this like a... I don't know what that is. Is that like the thing you rub the clothes against to dry it? <gasps> Love it. And then here she is this carrying laundry detergent. Also, there's a new outfit. When I first saw this dress, I really did not like it. I'll be honest. I can't remember if I said it in my last video, but I didn't like it. 
Uh, but it's growing on me now that I've seen it on her and been styled. Okay, so she was just carrying like a laundry bag type of thing. Oh, look, it's a sad fishy. So that's like non-eco-friendly and eco-friendly setting. <laughs> Cute. And there it goes. Uh, the kids can do the washing as well. This isn't just a adult teen interaction. So that's really nice to see that those animations have been added. Love how this guy's like stinky. Look at this gorgeous updo. Loving this hair. That is so, so nice. And oh my gosh, that's adorable with the little, the little toddler playing in the wash basket. Okay. And we saw that object on the wall. So I wonder if they take it off the wall or if they're two separate objects. That's really interesting. And the clothes will sparkle when they're finished. I like that a lot. New cardigan, another dress washing hamper. It looks like there's, a, it looks like there are a lot of new animations in this, which I think that's quite unusual for a stuff pack. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but it looks like there's a lot of unique animations. Uh, so you can either do the washing machine washing, or you can do that more traditional washing. Um, these are not new hairs. This looks like a new hair. That's a new hair. That's exciting. And New crop top, love that. Looks like some new jeans, potentially too. Oh, oh, we missed a nice chunk of info just then. Yes, they think we won't pick up on it, but we will. <laughs> okay, so we've got some really nice wall shelving units here where you can obviously place objects, but then we've got matching um, side tables there. I like how all the shelving goes together. It's definitely very realistic and more rustic looking. These shelves are really nice. I like the details on them. And this is everything. I love these new sinks. They're so cool. Different ironing boards. And here's that beautiful bay window. Okay, I thought there was actually a seat on it, but there isn't. Uh, it's just a ledge. Yay, we get a new square coffee table. Love that. The layered rugs are always a little bit of fun. And whilst it's very rustic and earthy looking, it's definitely got some really vibrant colors in it. New ottoman there. This looks like it's got a lot of stuff in it. Like for a stuff pack, we have a lot of, love that top by the way, love these pants, love those colors. Oh my God, I'm so excited. This guy is clashing the patterns to the nines. Love it, <laughs> new curtains. There is a lot of stuff, including all of the animation work. So this is potentially a really big stuff pack. Uh, oh my gosh, we have a hanging light bulb. Yes, new outdoor table, new chairs new decor items. This looks massive. New washing line. Look at all of these different, is he washing a zucchini? Was he washing a zucchini? <laughs> oh, that's funny. And hanging up the socks on the line. So there's all of that animation. And he looks so proud of himself, uh, which, which we love. So cool. Very, very happy there. All right, and that is it. Wash your wardrobe in both ways. Build a rustic home. Oh, look at that tree. That is a nice tree. Loving the tree, you guys. Bay window is beautiful. Love these candles. I think this looks like it is definitely worth your money. Look at that crop top. Very cute new hair, kids' new clothes. Uh, I don't expect we'll get much for kids' new clothes, but I like it. New top there. We already had these shorts. I think they are existing boots, but they could be new ones. I guess this is new hair for guys. Just really, really nice. Oh, that's a new top as well. And those are definitely new pants. New hair, so pretty. Look how beautifully styled that is. So yeah, laundry day stuff pack. Now, I also thought I would head to the blog with you guys just to get a little bit more background information. So let's have a look at this. Do your Sims long for that moment of taking out nice warm clothing fresh from the dryer? Soon they can with the Sims for Laundry Day Stuff Pack. Launching Jan 16, 2018 worldwide on PC and Mac. Yes, so that is only in five days time, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This pack was made in collaboration with our amazing community who by participating in six surveys over the course of six months, help determine what was included from the theme to gameplay and even the name. It has been an awesome journey to include all of you in this product and we couldn't be happier with the final result. Of course, this pack was voted on by 
players, if you guys are involved with The Sims 4 community online in the forums and whatnot, you've probably seen the opportunity to vote. And that's a massive effort, you know, for EA to actually take into account what players want to make the surveys for us to vote upon, to work as hard as they can to include everyone's perspectives in the pack. I mean, that you've got to say that that's a pretty good effort and that's really, really nice of them. I, I respect that a lot. In the Sims 4 Laundry Day Stuff Pack, your Sims will enjoy a new gameplay focus on the most relaxing of chores, laundry. Is it relaxing? <laughs> Sims will install sparkling new washing and drying machines to their homes so they're always wearing the best and brightest clothes. For Sims who prefer being out in the fresh air, they can also use a wash tub to scrub stains to their heart's content, then hang it dry on the clothesline to peacefully admire their hard work. <laughs> Love it. Don't like doing laundry? No problem. Transfer your Sim, transform your Sims home into a more rustic abode with country inspired decor that will make your Sims feel like they're the one with nature. Home items include wood tables, wicker furniture, colorful rugs, floral filled baskets, and more. I love all of that. So nice. Is your Sim craving some new down to earth additions to their wardrobe? Well, they're in luck with all new country themed attire adorned with beautiful floral patterns plus some laid back denim. Enjoy hassle-free hairstyles to complement a more relaxed and comfortable look. We look forward to seeing what you create with the Sims 4 Laundry Day Stuff Pack when it releases on Jan 16 worldwide. If you haven't already, follow our socials, yada yada yada. Okay, you guys, well, sound off in the comments down below what you think of this pack. I'm personally very impressed. I think it looks like you get a lot in it. Uh, I think animation, we know, takes so much time. To me, when the Sims are interacting with so many different objects, that shows that this is quite a big pack and you are getting a lot for your buck. So I'm impressed. I also think we don't really have this aesthetic in the game yet. We don't have the rustic country vibe in this way. I mean, we have cats and dogs, which yes, you could say is a little bit country rustic though. I'm not so sure. I think this is a really nice balance of aesthetics that we don't already have much of in the game. So I'm excited about that. To me, it's looking like it's a pretty good stuff pack coming out and for us to look forward to. Anyway, let me know in the comments down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And of course, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon or evening wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon.